how flawless is this wig hi welcome back to my channel this is Kunfi and in this video I'll be showing you the complete process of transforming a wig into a stunning layered styled with flawless finish if you're interested please continue watching let's get into it I like starting with adding a little bit of water to my front part which is the lace and I add also a little bit of mousse just to achieve you know the flawless flawless at the end so I feel like the water is just like you know to put all the hair in places and then the the mousse is just you know to give that uh, flawless stunning you know laying all the hair in places just you know to keep that perfect blowout at the end so what you're seeing I'm doing a video actually just blowing out the hair to make sure that it's laying uh, flat and straight before I start cutting the layers so I like to cut starting from the front like the upper part of the wig so I section um, the, the the smaller portion which is more like the forehead and then I cut like that according to the type and the length you are trying to achieve so now I'm trying to achieve not the bangs but like something more layered uh, from the upper but not too sharp so and then I do the process the same I just take from one side to the other side and then I hold it and then I fold it a little bit like twist it just so that at the end is giving like a very nice dimension of cutting for those who doesn't know me my name is Queen V and I am usually a youtuber but it's been a long time that I haven't uploaded a video on my YouTube channel. I think the last video I uploaded was four years ago, I would say. So I took a break from YouTube uh, for four years simply because of like family, you know. I got pregnant and I was raising a child and to raise a child is not that simple at a whole you know it takes a whole village to raise a child so i think that's the main reason why i stepped back you know i just wanted to take care of my child and not have to film and record and to be honest i i, I tried i did attempt to try and film when my child was probably two years but it didn't work. I think at that time it's like when I do the setup of the lighting and the stuff like the, the the studio area, my daughter actually just come and start like unplugging my stuff. You know, like she she's curious and she just wanna play with them and it's not working. So and then two years later, here I am. Yeah, so she's quite grown now and all that. So yeah, I think um, you'll be seeing more uh, videos. I will be uploading a lot on based on how to style, and I will spice it up a little bit with uh, some fashion haul, um, all that. But yeah, I am back, and I am back for good in this time. And I'm playing. You see how flawless is that blowout at the top part of the head, and this is what I am talking about. It's layered, it's perfect. So you, I like to go in with the wax just to make sure that I won't have any fly out or any messiness. And this just helps that when I'm gonna hot comb, like it's gonna make the hair super flat, super silk, like neat. Like I like to have a very neat, um, clean uh partings uh and baby hair like you know just just laid back like all the hair like the like the the root and the front line is like neat and clean i'm not gonna add baby hair on this week uh because this week is for a client and my client prefer it without baby hair actually this is a custom made wig i customize it myself i did this week myself with a, a five by five lace and 
24 inch bundles three bundles yes like super full hair so yeah so once you 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 completed the process of 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 layering and then blow out and then making sure that your lace is snatched so i go in with the curls and i like to start from the upper part this gives me a better idea of what i'm working with in you know i think it's give like a good dimension to start from the upper part of the head like going down 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 so what i'll be doing i'll be just doing like a one um a one curl along the whole head i'm not gonna section it in two parts because i'm just trying to achieve like curls but more like low base so this is done that's it it's the same process so you just keep on doing repetition and the uh, upper part i curled up a little bit with a creep just you know so that it holds stronger so i like to go in with my hands a little bit first before the comb just to make sure that you know i like go in 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 but not like removing all the curl so say hi to my sis so i call her natalie so so i'll be styling my wig on natalie today and this is the finished product this is how it looks this time it's not combed out yet so i'm starting with the combing out process right now combing out all the curls just to put them in positions of how you want them to lay how you want them to lay wow i think i am actually happy with the results i love how the curls are and the goal was not to go curls on the back of the head which is good just to have them lower and yeah i'm really happy with the outcome like wow look at that flawless stunning and this color of the wig is in natural color um, 1b and it's giving volume body waves bouncy very demure <laughs> wow i think i love it and they are holding up so well i'm quite happy with the curls but they are holding up really really well so it's absolutely stunning please late my work one up to ten comment down below the section don't forget to subscribe Thank you for watching.